Hey everyone, I'm Max Dalton, and in this video I'll show you how to change your default keyboard on an Android device. If you're frustrated with the default keyboard on your Android device, don't worry. You can change it. You can download and try out different keyboards for your Android device from the Google Play Store. In addition to a different keyboard layout, other keyboards may also give you the option to change your keyboard color or theme. Now let's walk through the steps to change the default keyboard on your Android device. Step 1. Download the keyboard you want to use from the Google Play Store on your Android device. In this example, I'll download Google's Gboard. Step 2. Swipe up on your Android device's home screen to display the app screen and then tap Settings. The Settings screen is displayed. Step 3. Scroll down and tap General Management and then tap Language and Input on the General Management screen. The Language and Input screen is shown. Step 4. Tap On Screen Keyboard in the Keyboard section and then tap Manage Keyboards on that screen. The keyboard app you installed on your Android device should be displayed in this list. Step 5. Tap to turn on the toggle associated with the keyboard you installed on your Android device that you want to use. In this example, I'll turn on Gboard. A warning may appear that your keyboard may be able to collect the text you type and personal information. Tap OK on that warning. Step 6. Navigate back to the Language and Input section and then tap Default Keyboard. A Select Keyboard window is shown. Choose the keyboard you want to change to use. The window will close and your new keyboard will be shown in the default keyboard section. Now, your newly selected keyboard will show up whenever a keyboard is displayed going forward. Let me know what your favorite Android keyboard is in the comments below. If you liked what you saw here, click the video links on the right side of the screen to check out another video. Or click the logo on the left side of the screen to check out my website to see more great tutorials like this one.